So we took 12 clones of Coleus and we're doing a clone off between two different products that we have, Azos and Root Tech. We were asked by someone online to do this. And this is day three of the experiment. The Azos and the Root Tech. And the Azos is still standing perfect. And the root tech's looking pretty sad. So we're gonna monitor these until we see roots and see which one did the best. And all right, and we're treating these both the same. They both get sprayed once a day with cup solution. Uh, both have a little bit of water in the bottom of the tray to keep the humidity high. And both have humidity domes completely closed. Here is day four of our experiment, Azos versus Rutec. Um, we have still a slight little bit of limp stems on the Rutec. Looks like it got stressed a little during that cloning. And then over here on the Azos, never really showed any signs of stress. And uh, as you can see, standing tall, not sagging at all. And I come over here to the Rutec, still standing, um, you can see right there, a little bit of flopping. But everything's still alive and looking okay. This is day nine of our Azos and Root Tech experiment. Um, they're both just starting to show roots. The Azos are pretty much perfectly healthy. And the Root Tech look pretty good. Just a few of the leaves are wilted. A little dry looking. They've been taken care of really well. The Azos has a few roots. And they're all looking perfect. That one really doesn't have any poking out. And the Rutec, they look okay. A little bit of root growth, pretty much the same as the Azos. Maybe a little bit less. Then there's a droopy leaf. And I just watered these like five minutes ago. So it looks like the Azos has a little more roots and all around they did a lot better than the Root Tech. They just stood up perfect the entire time, didn't really drop. Uh, the Root Tech dropped and then slowly came back and some of them never really did. Um, so we're going to keep an eye on this for the next couple days and see how it finishes up. Good. So this is the final day of our Azos Root Tech video experiment. And Root Tech did pretty well. Has some pretty nice roots. Uh, they did get stressed out a little bit. Some fell. Um, they're doing pretty good. So 
some of them are doing really good. Altogether, the root tech did pretty well. Um, they still fell, like they didn't stand up the whole time. Um, we had roots on the top before we really had any poking out of the bottom. Some of them still don't have a lot of root growth and by this time they really should. So that was the root tech. And this is our Azos tray. And the Azos roots are just more full. And this is the exact same amount of time, they were both treated equal. Like every single one I pull out. This has done awesome. And like they never dropped, they never drooped at all. They just stood up the whole time, did really well. Uh, didn't get stressed out at all. And every one of them has really good root formation. So I would definitely say out of Azos and Root Tech, Azos won. Best root tech and just grab a random. 